and it didn't work, but I'm back. Uh, what's going on? It's been like a year, it feels like, since I've streamed, I have, since the World Championships, basically, I haven't hit that go live button, mostly because I've been doing some uh, recorded stuff instead and just been busy. I'm here p playing a team match with Warren. We don't play together at the Nationals anymore, but we're still partners, so we're playing a team match here. All right. He promised six. I'm going to bid three clubs. This will kind of talk about the spade problem. It also leaves partner room to preference back to diamonds. If he preferences back to diamonds, I'm going to think that no trumps is going to become a, a problem. Could easily see if he's got a stiff spade that slam could easily be right. Uh, so we're playing a 20 board team match here. Uh, how's everybody doing? Where's my chat? Where's the chat? It's been so long. Okay. All right. Hey, Vavs. How you doing? Found the chat. I don't even have my stream set up very well for, for this. Uh, all right. So we got the preference. I feel like I gotta, I can't bid, I don't want to sit for 3-0. No. He didn't just bid 3-0. No. So the reason he didn't bid 3-0 no was either because he has a spade problem or he's got a good hand. Man, I can bid three spades. Three spades is going to tell him that I got a spade problem. Yeah, let's see what happens if I bid three spades. He's going to know I'm bidding the fourth suit. I, he's going to know I have short hearts now. So, okay, let's see what he, what, what he says to that double. If he bids three, no. I'm going to sit for it. If he passes, I'm going to bid four diamonds. Redouble. That's interesting. I'm going to bid four diamonds to confirm that we're going in diamonds. I think his three his redouble might have been a half stopper. Pass might have been a half stopper. I don't know. We could easily have a slam. Uh, he could have like the if he has weak hearts, but he he's not gonna know. He'll know, I guess, that I have short hearts. So, okay. So, are we in the right contract? We had eight top tricks and no trump, probably nine. I got issues. So, king, I'm gonna win the ace. Play the king of hearts. Take a roughing finesse, and then that way, even if it lost, I think I would be okay. Ten of hearts, okay. Club to the king. Queen of hearts. Jack, that was an interesting card. I think I can go nine of hearts making him rough. That seems like a practical thing to do. Yeah, I'm happy to be back. When Warren texted me to play today, I'm like, oh, great, let's do it. I haven't done it in so long, so I was pretty excited. Now I'm gonna, my plan here is going to be to rough a club and then play the eight of hearts throwing in the other club. I just hope the club doesn't get over roughed. I'm going to cash the ace of diamonds first just to be safe. Or maybe is that even right? So if I, I'm going to rough, I can cash the ace. Then if I get over roughed, it's a problem. That's ah, the same thing. Ace of diamonds. Ace of clubs. And now I just need this club rough to live and I'm going to make it. So, but otherwise, if it doesn't, I'm down. That looks good. Ah! Brutal. Down one. That was unfortunate. Maybe I could have done better. Problem was, when I heard Warren had the ace of spades, I was starting to think about slam. I was on. Wow, what did they do? They stopped in 3 0. They opened in front, I see.
this is a funny question about seven six zero zero. So it's hard for me to talk about other things when I'm playing. Sorry, um, my sound is lagging the visuals. Uh, try refreshing. I don't know how that would be. Uh, I, I don't know how I could fix that on my end. Okay, good. So it sounds like it's just you, Dave. Um, all right, I have 17 and four hearts. Not enough for slam, unless what, 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 if a partner has ace doubleton of spades and ace of clubs, ace of diamonds, we might make a slam in diamonds. But I don't see how I'm going to figure out that he has three aces. I could bid two diamonds, game force. He's going to bid two hearts. I could bid three diamonds. He'll know with three aces that he's got a good hand, but how is he going to know that, that he need a doubleton spade? Um, I think I'm just going to bid three now. Ace, ace, ace. I guess I... Hmm. So my only choice is to bid two, two diamonds, which is going to expose a whole lot about his hand. And will he know? King, queen of spades, ace of clubs, ace of diamonds. Thirteen. That's in the game. Ace, king of spades, ace of diamonds, queen of clubs. That's man, there's a lot of hands. I gotta do it. I gotta bid two diamonds and just show them like some slam interest. Um, hello, uh, hello, Ahmed. Thank you. I'm going to bid three diamonds now. And this is going to make it pretty clear to Warren that I don't have five hearts. It should do because I'm not raising his two hearts to three hearts. And now I know he has three hearts. He's probably four triple three now. Um, yeah, or I guess if he has ace doubleton of spades and three hearts. I guess at this point, I really hope he just bids three no. So risky. You go starting investigating slam, and then it just I might be taking a completely uh, normal hand, and then turning it into an enough into like a, a swing hand when he just gets too excited with some hand. I'm so happy he just bid three no. I can just sit back and make three no. But it just felt like when I was building hands there, I built like three quick hands that we make slam. So it felt unreasonable for me to just sign off with three no. But then whenever you bid two diamonds followed by three diamonds, you're kind of opening the door for partner to just like get excited on some random hand and it just doesn't fit well. And yeah, yeah, we don't have a slam on this hand. He had a bad hand, so he, he kind of knew not to get excited. So we lost 13 on that board that we played five diamonds. A little unlucky, five diamonds went down in the end. Although, was it a good contract? I mean, it's kind of the same thing. They both kind of need, like, uh, yeah, I don't think five diamonds was that much worse than three no trumps. Three no trumps would have gone down if diamonds were 4-1. Uh, if But five diamonds would have made, uh, even with diamonds, 4-1, uh, if the ace of hearts was on side. So it's pretty close what, what the better contract was. I'm, I don't know, maybe... But 3-0 no is a little easier on, on, like, average hands. I guess if they let a club, it's just base 5, 6, 7, 8. No, it's, it's yeah, I don't think that we do, did that badly by playing 5 diamonds on that hand. Uh, yeah, so I haven't been around for a while. If, if you're new, I, I guess there are probably not new, many new people here right now because you probably all got the notification that I'm live and that's why you're here. So uh, welcome back, everybody. I'm trying to just juggle too many things, and streaming is just uh low on my uh, priority list. Maybe in the summer uh, we'll have a little bit more time. P I'm actually playing more bridge than before, which is cool, good, nice. Did Warren just make an end play? Well done. 
And we got the swing back. Did they bid slam on that hand? All right. Why? What happened? The diamond, they also bid two diamonds with with my hand and three diamonds. But Warren bid three. Warren's hand bid three spades to show spade values, and my hand went on. I would not have gone on for what it's worth. I was ready to sign off. I feel I had felt like I had done my job. Uh, I'd done my job by bidding three diamonds. Like I told my partner, I had a slam try in diamonds. So I, f I felt like if he had the right thirteen or fourteen count, he was gonna drive like if he had three aces and ace fifth of diamonds he would have been like okay I can't have a better hand than this so he would have known to bid slam and that's really the, the job I was trying to accomplish okay club pass a heart double a spade I don't have a fit. A heart showed spades. They play transfers after a club. Uh, can I bid two clubs natural? His double showed takeout of clubs and spades. I'm going to bid uh, two diamonds here. I'm just going to force him up a level. No. I can double for takeout. That's what I'm going to do. Or even just bid one no. No, double. Oh well, welcome. Uh, I'm glad you've been watching some of the old, uh, some of the streams that are or the old streams that were up there. Lots of lots of content there. I hope that Warren takes us his takeout. I don't really want him. To, uh, I don't want to bid uh, two diamonds and find out. Ah, that was not what I wanted to hear. No, that was not cool. Uh oh. Well, hopefully he's got five of them. I mean, he must have five of them. I was trying to get to like a club fit here. Oh, please don't tell me you didn't bid two hearts on four. He already showed four hearts. He showed four hearts and diamonds. So I was trying to, like, get clubs into the game or or get him to bid diamonds. So, yeah, if he's 5-4 in the red suits with five hearts, then I guess we're in a perfectly reasonable contract. I don't know if that was smart, though. He might. If he has four hearts, I'm going to feel like a complete fish. But he shouldn't have four hearts. He showed four hearts. Okay, well, unfortunate that we got to this yucky 5-2 fit, and they got off to a pretty good lead, although this might not be that. But, yeah, they're tapping us is the issue here. I one no was the winner by me, huh? Yeah, that would have been reasonable. I had jack there to spades, though, and it was, wasn't clear that they didn't have an 8-card fit. Like, partner even could have had a stiff spade. Hmm. It's not really a, a significant hand here. It's just 50 points a trick. We definitely had a fun game this morning on, on it was an annoying game but a fun game on Wednesday morning. I feel like we, we gave it a good effort. Couldn't catch somebody who had a m monster game. Could have done it. Could have done it. All right. Well, that was good that they shifted to diamonds. That was definitely very helpful for the home team. Now drop the yeah, he's going to maybe drop the king. Cuz if they're 3-3 three, three, it doesn't matter and no, okay. 
All right, this looks like we are going to make the contract. We've lost. That's our fourth loser. We've got a spade loser. Uh, he has. I mean, it's kind of free to finesse spades here, unless they they just rough with the jack of hearts with a lower heart. Uh, but oh well. He yeah, he didn't do it. Ten was offside anyway. So they've been 1-0 with my hand. No, they didn't come in. Man, there's a diff different actions. Oh, they opened Warren's hand. Oh, yeah. Did Warren not open that hand? Man, I haven't played with him in a few months, and he got... Oh, no, he... Oh, wrong hand. Sorry, my bad. Club pass a heart, pass a spade. Oh, they didn't make a take a double with Warren's hand. Uh-huh. That's weird. It's definitely going to take a double. So this is a 20 board match. Uh, not playing for anything, just practicing. Seems like Susina runs these uh, team games every day at 3 o'clock. Uh, I guess Warren is a regular in them. Oh, vulnerable. I hate passing one no with the singleton, but vulnerable at imps, I'm going to just pass. Cry. Ooh, look at that dummy. Nine count. He was waiting for me. Lars Arthur. Oh, it was one known twelve to fourteen? No, I I don't believe so. Uh, oh, I, I thought that I thought. Sorry, I, I thought that they just play uh, s s standard. Um, what do I need to do? I can discard like the nine of diamonds. Let them know. Let's see if they have a convention card. They don't. We do. So Warren's Jack of Clubs is suit preference. He's telling me that he has a spade entry. Uh, if, if I can get in. Um, I guess that was silly for me to give them the diamond situation. But I have the heart trick, so he thinks they're going to break. I'm going to even drop the 10 of hearts here. Just mess with him. Well, there was nothing to do on this hand. Uh, all we could ever get was four clubs and two diamonds, so him guessing the diamond actually didn't help him at all. But we lost imps on the board. Why, did they balance with my hand? No, they bid with Warren's. Yeah, and I guess I would have bid with Warren's hand too. He had a four card major, longer minor, and he could have doubled. Um, Oh, I wonder what major Warren has. So his two diamond bid shows one long major. I know exactly which one it is, and I'm going to pick it off by bidding two spades and having the no trumper on lead.
So I don't have a way of insisting on hearts. When I bid two hearts over two diamonds, it's going to tell partner to pass if they have hearts or bid two spades if they have spades. If they double for penalty, though, then I have a way. Then I can suggest two hearts to play uh, over the double. So let's see if they double for penalty. Uh, if, they, if, if I can escape in hearts. No, perfect. I'm off the hook. Oh, I just no, I thought we were in trouble. We're not in trouble anymore. That's amazing. I think he has spades. Uh, two diamonds should definitely be alerted. It's definitely not standard. Anything that shows suit that you do, that you're not bidding the suit you have is pretty much alertable. Like the only time exceptions to that are like stamen, where everybody in the whole world plays it. But no, it's definitely not standard to play two diamonds. Shows a major. But the reason that we don't see alerted is because he's my partner, and so so uh, he alerts his own bids. Okay, so it sounds like the spades are six five one one around the table. So do I lead my stiff spade or do I lead the king of hearts? Is the question. Um, and the spades might might be six four two one. That's possible. That lefty only has four spades, but he went to the trouble of bidding spades. He didn't know that was what the major is. So his three spade bid was natural. He thought that my partner's suit was hearts. Obviously, I have hearts, so it's not that weird that he had it wrong. Uh, Declare doesn't know. I think I still have to lead my stiff. It, yeah, so they were 6 5 one, one around the table. Okay. Funny. He could have opened a spade, and then my partner would have never gotten involved. I wonder if Declare still knows. He might not know, but probably he knows now what the suits are. I should I have maybe led a heart? Would it have been better? Not if partner's got singleton nine of hearts. Promoting a little trump tricky here. Even if he's got King Jack seventh of diamonds, boom. Looks like he's got the rest. He's got seven diamonds, one spade, three two. Yeah, so there's nothing we can do. We're, 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 he's got clubs are three three, so they're all his. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough to beat the contract. They missed a pretty good slam, as a matter of fact. No king of hearts lead. King of hearts lead would have been would have been good enough to uh, beat slam. No, so would obviously a spade as it was. The Ten of Diamonds was suit preference. Yeah, I mean, I was just trying to make sure that he knew to uh, to play back spades. Wow, we lost a huge swing on that one. Because they played three no Trump doubled going down to... He went one spade pass, one no pass, 
two spades showing spades and clubs. Pass three diamonds to play. Pass three no trump. Rip. Uh huh. Oh, they could have just ducked. They could have saved one trick, but. All right, we were just kind of a victims of our seats here. That was a nice result in the other room. And here he chose to open one to Trump with a really weird hand with ace, fifth of spades and a singleton. Definitely not my thing, but it worked out really cleanly for him. Yeah, that's that should be extra values from Warren. I have a really good hand for him. Uh, we haven't really talked about what we do in this spot. I think I'm gonna cube bid and then I, I mean I have such a good hand for him. I really have a four diamond bid. Ace King six the diamonds ace. Ace King fourth the diamonds, Ace King six the clubs, and we're in pretty good shape in game. He's going to be six four here a lot. I'm going to cubid two spades here to start. I wonder what, whether he'll take it as a slow down bid or I could just bid four diamonds. We're not going to make three no trump. I don't know. This is just cleaner. I don't. I don't know what he's going to take three because we normally play some slow down stuff after reverses, but I don't think it's supposed to apply in competition. So I, I'm just going to give him a four, four diamonds raise and and let him push it to five. Um, I have a really good dummy for him. Maybe I didn't even bid enough. But I, that's kind of my thing is that I, I, I didn't want, he could, we could easily have a slam. Ace, king, queen, fourth of, well, he'd need to have like seven, four. Seven, four, one, one. But I, I wanted to leave him room to key card. Yeah, Modern Bridge is pretty competitive for sure. These people are overcalling aggressively, and like that one spade bid is probably a joke. I, I mean, just judging by the values, Lefty, you can trust the Cubid. I mean, they might be counting shortness points over there with it for their two club, but they still. Uh, all right, so. I thought he had a better hand. Good pass by him. We might not make this. All right, well, that's good. That's definitely a, a nice development, finding the queen of diamonds on side. It was very, very positive. So now nine, diamond of the nine, we still got, we still got problems. We need them, the clubs to break 3-3. Three, three. Come on, clubs, give me some love. I, I feel bad about my bidding here. Ugh. Oh. All right, thank you. Making five? Well, I didn't bid enough. <laughs> Oops.
Okay, so. by leading I'm guess I'm leading passive sorry I, I had an email I had to reply to He's, he's, uh, I've got a diamond on her here. Give him a little teeny weeny high low there in diamonds. So I actually have a, a story of why I can type so quickly, Babs, which is pretty funny. So when I, when I was uh, a teenager, I got terribly, terribly, terribly addicted uh, to a video game called EverQuest, which was like a Dungeons and Dragons -y type game where you had to work. It was an online game with a bunch of people who um, you had to work together as a team. It was like it was just as the internet was becoming, you could play these games online with other people. And uh, I just pitched a loser, I think, when I pitched. I pitched a club that was not good. Um, so. Talking and over tricks don't work. Don't don't do well together. Um, uh, sorry. So where was where was that? So so I played this game and and like the whole game was, was uh, you had to work together with a team to beat these big dragons. You needed like healers and warriors and and at the time it just like there was no voice chat over the internet. So like the only way we could coordinate with each other was through text. And a lot of these battles against these monsters were were um, intense and 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 fast paced and so if you weren't a quick typist you just you couldn't survive so i i became a, a an incredibly quick typist during that period of my life i'll give it a little week too i wish my suit was a little better but first chair i gotta do it i blew a trick then it cost me what one Oh, because they got to lead the Queen of Diamonds on the other side. And oh, that dro they dropped my King of Spades. Okay. This doesn't seem bad. Low discouraging. get non-vol at teams there's not that much of an incentive to get the game so at vol like he said what i think he was pretty much spot on with what he said he said if he was vulnerable he would have put in the game yeah as vulnerable you're getting 10 to 6 for bidding game when you're non-vulnerable you're getting 6 to 5 so bidding like crappy games or, or, or close games at not vol is just not it's not a the imps is just like a cop out you know it's just basically like match points so i can't tell do I play a dime back or a trump? If I play a trump, that's going to give him time to set up a club. If I play a dime back, it's going to let him rough a diamond. What's up, Stefan? How are you doing? It's faster on Twitch than YouTube if you want to flip over. 
you're like a few seconds behind everybody else, maybe 30. Uh, so what do I do? Uh, he played back, hold on a second, he played back the seven of diamonds. Yeah, he, he has seven deuce doubleton. So I could play back a diamond. That's going to mean that if, 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 Warren, if Warren has like jack four at the trumps, Declare's going to play heart to the ace, diamond rough, and Warren's going to have to rough in with the seven of spades. It's going to cost a diamond and a thing at the same time. And that only matters if Declare's got three clubs, two clubs. Um, then th that's the only time I need to play a diamond if Declare has a doubleton club. Yeah. So it's a diamond or a trump. Feels close. Diamond or Trump. I know Warren's got good spades. If I lead a diamond, he might not be able to get back to his hand. He will, though, with a heart. Um, six, two, three, two. Is that what Declare is? Six, two, three, two? Yeah. I think I, I, I'm torn. I'm playing a diamond. I hope, I hope Warren doesn't have like a slow trump trick. If Declare has three clubs and it's six one three three, I'm gonna feel pretty foolish. Ah, Warren had a stiff diamond. Ew, that's weird. Or he's just busy. What's he, he's thinking about not roughing? That can't be right. Am I still connected? Can you guys hear me? Okay. Thank you. Oh, okay. All right, so. If Warren has the ace of hearts, that would be the best of all worlds because now Declare can't get back to his hand. But I predict it's going to go hard to the ace diamond. Uh, and then we have to hope Warren doesn't rough with a natural trump trick. Tell me that wasn't natural. Cash your club. I'm gonna play the uh, 10, you're gonna play a, queen, a heart, I'm gonna rough it, and then let's try and promote that trump trick back that we just blew. Please, cash the club, cash the club. King of clubs, channel the king of clubs, okay. And then the heart, which I rough, 10. And the only question is, don't play the queen of hearts, make my life easy and play the jack of hearts, please. Because then I don't have to think about it. The queen of hearts, I have to think, do I rough? That's four tricks. <laughs> I, I, this is me at the bridge table. I have a poker face, but <laughs> I don't want the queen. I guess I, so if, if there's, I'm pretty sure I have to rough this. Declare has three diamonds, two clubs, two six. Is there ever wrong for me to rough my partner's trick? I think either way we're going to get this trick and we're going to maybe promote a trunk trick. I feel like I need to rough it. Well, I could throw a club. Then if Declare actually has three clubs. Oh, does Warren have four spades? He roughed with the nine. So Declare definitely has the seven, eight of spades. Is it ever going to matter? Yes, if Warren had queen, nine, third of spades... That means declare it ace king jack six of spades doubleton heart three diamonds i have to rough if that's the hand i can't promote a trick so i'm just gonna rough and promote i'm doing it i'm sorry this could this could be wrong <clears throat> sorry 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 i don't know okay it didn't matter
See, if Warren had Queen Doubleton in the exact same hand, I had to trump his Queen of Hearts. And was it right for me to play a diamond back? Did it matter? to shift to the king of hearts huh interesting I don't see it what could he have done ace he could have just played trumps oh because Warren would have just been end played interesting and actually it's not that weird that that's what happened not that weird that that would happen because Warren can't get to my diamond. The diamond, we just never get a diamond trick. Uh, maybe I should have seen that. Uh, I should have seen that. I should have seen that I could never get in again. And and I should have just played back a... Uh, what do I have to play back? A trump? No, the king of hearts. Why did the king of hearts matter? So if I play the king of hearts, he wins the ace. Oh, because then we can promote a trump trick. I see it. Because then uh, on said I can throw my club on the king, queen of hearts and then play a third club and I can rough with the ten of spades to promote his second trump trick. So we would get two spades, a heart, two clubs, and a diamond. That's why. Because I because we could promote a trump. I could throw away my club on the queen of hearts is the key. Uh-huh. A little bit cheating with the, with the double dummy. But it, sometimes even with the double dummy. But look, the double dummy helps you try to figure out how to solve it okay as much as that that's kind of a skill that you have to develop uh, being able to look at a, uh, a full hand record and be able to figure out how things go because really that that same skill translates to uh, when you know the whole hand in the middle of the hand figuring out how to beat it like you, you, it's a skill and I, I definitely got some of that skill from uh, reading adventures in card play I definitely spent a lot of time studying these obscene positions to see how you might solve them double dummy problems are actually good for that purpose for sure uh, all right, a heart pass, a spade pass, three clubs. What was that? Clubs or heart game force? Which one is it? Hearts. Okay, so he's got a single suited heart game force, and the other guy bid three no. Um, it's either the nine of clubs or the nine of diamonds. feels like nine of clubs but why did he ask he must maybe he has to let me ask him did you have to ask Because if he didn't have to ask, then I know he's got clubs. So I'm going to pump a diamond. Um, I'm leading the nine of diamonds. Because otherwise, if he didn't care whether it was hearts or hearts and clubs, then he could have just bid three no. So he cared. So that means he's got clubs. So if I'm going to lead a random side suit, it looks like the, that he's 4-1... Well, it could be 4-1-4-4. Four, 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 whatever. Either way, my partner's got shortness in clubs now. So I should have led low.
I'm more than halfway through this match. We're playing 20 boards. Yeah, what do you have here? It's 17. 17, yeah, that's a pretty... It's a good call. That is definitely a hyper-aggressive game force that he's chosen. It is a really good hand with Ace-King, Jack-10, Six of Hearts. Like, obviously, that's going to take five tricks opposite of Void. Uh, you're... But, yeah, that's a hand that you kind of want to upgrade to no trump. 17. Yeah, if your partner, you, you kind of want to, like, open. You have two no. It's like I treat that hand like a 20. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's very close. It's that's a, I would say that it's definitely more than a 17 count. Um, but you're right. That it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, definitely, it's definitely aggressive. Like, the problem is that you, the problem I have is, is when, when you have ace, king, jack, 10, sixth of a suit, then when you have the normal, like, one heart pass, one spade pass, um, uh, three hearts. Partner's going to be looking at a singleton or void in hearts with like seven or eight points, and they're going to choose to pass. Uh, so God, I should have led low. I really crushed this nine lead was terrible. Declara has queen eight fourth, I think, and. Uh, I don't know. Uh, sorry. So what I was saying was partner over a heart of spade three hearts with a singleton or void in hearts is going to downgrade their close calls. And when you have ace, king, jack, ten, six, you really like it, it's it, you don't want partner downgrading for the fact that they have a stiff heart. So I'm always like pretty keen to upgrade my hand when I have such a good suit that plays so well opposite a void or a singleton. Uh, so because I'm, I'm always afraid my partner is not going to evaluate their hand as well as they could and so but I don't know what the other choice was what was his other rebid three arts just feels like an underbid for this hand and game feels like an overbid so I don't know I, I don't I don't I don't think it's crazy anyway game forcing was not crazy and he has to yeah just three arts feels like such an underbid but you're not vol so can't just give the pep talk that six to five is not worth bidding aggressively so it is a 2-0 no opener for what it's worth. Like, at board a match, if I was playing board a match, I would be, yeah, for sure, uh, that's not good. 8-jack. Oh, it can't be right for me to cover that. They got queen-jack-10. Gotta grab the ace. What do you have? Ace ten doubleton? Oh no, you can't grab the ace. He can't grab it. Yeah, right. He can't. What's the clear shape? He's f is he five one four three? That's the only way we have a chance to beat this hand. But <coughs> I shouldn't have. Maybe I should have given him count. Uh, I'm sorry, Warren. I should have given you count. I was thinking I didn't want to give Declare count, but I should have given Warren count. Oh, maybe it didn't matter. Warren's going to get end played now. We really could never beat this hand. It actually got pretty interesting with the five-one heartbreak. I certainly, if I had led a low, a low diamond, they were down. I mean, it must have been that they were down. I don't know, but they must be. Oh, was I supposed to cover the queen of spades with the king? Was that what I was supposed to do? No, that can't be right either. Yeah, I had to lead a low diamond. No other suit would have worked, Babs.
I could have led the seven. I don't even know why I led the nine. I don't know what I was thinking. I should have just led second highest from my bad holding. I don't know what the nine was. I just like I was so busy thinking about the nine of clubs that I led the nine. I can't believe that that cost. I hate my life. Well, we got it anyway. What happened here? Wait, we lost two? Okay, well, I have a pretty good hand for clubs. He didn't make a negative double. I'm going to bid, if I bid two spades, like he's going to bid three clubs because he doesn't have a spade stopper. And then I'm just going to have to decide whether to bid five or not, or three no. I have nine tricks if he's got a diamond stopper and ace queen fifth of clubs. Uh, well, I can start by cubiting. Is it going to be better to play in three no or five clubs? Five clubs is going to be really hard. Well, taking 11 tricks on this hand, ace queen fifth of clubs. I need to know whether he has good diamonds or not. They're going to lead a diamond. And he didn't make a negative double. So they have a nine card diamond fit a lot. Often. So what's he? Two, two, three, six. I feel like he's gonna make five five if he's got a six club he's gonna make it for sure he didn't open three clubs he didn't open one club so if he's got six, I just don't know if he has he rebid clubs though so so maybe that's a sign that he has six clubs he didn't make a negative double he doesn't have a spade stopper so what's his shape that he didn't like bid three hearts he's two two three six that's his shape I'm just gonna bid five clubs it, this could be wrong too I'm, uh, I don't know. I'm just guessing. So, Steph, I would not invert two clubs and two diamonds as past hands. It's too often right to pass two of a minor. Uh, it's a question of what do you think about, about inverting two clubs and two diamonds. I just think that, like, the most common auction in these spots uh, are um, is pass, pass, pass when you're a past hand. It's like the, the what are you waiting for? Like, well, we play, at least I play weak two diamonds. So, like, it's not even like that you have that, that kind of... Um, uh, yeah. 
Uh, I think you need a way for double to show uh, both minors. Oh, he's thinking about slam. Ooh. You can't. No, I didn't bid four clubs. I jumped to five clubs. I jumped to five clubs. That was. Oh, no. That can't be. We can't be making six clubs. I mean, I guess we could be, but. I don't have a terrible hand for this. I didn't bid four clubs. I didn't cubit and bid four clubs. I cubit and jumped to five clubs. <laughs> um, so I, what would three spades have been? He's doubling for a heart lead. Two spades is a bit of an overbid. I just, what do you mean? It was my only forcing bid. This is the, in fact the only bid I could make with my hand. I, don't, I didn't even have a second choice. Um, so you mean a diamond, a spade, having two clubs as hearts? Yeah, that could definitely it definitely has value, Steph. Because uh, you're you you, but for sure it has value. There's upsides and there's downsides to it both. But obviously it's better for. Uh... All right, you got to figure out who has queen third of clubs here. Well, that's good claim. He had a huge hand. I'm surprised he didn't open. I would have opened his hand for what it's worth. All right, coming back. Coming back. We got 13, 13 M's to make up in seven boards. Uh, he had an easy claim if, if, if he says queen third. He, he, he didn't need to rough the diamond. He could use my king of spades to throw away uh, to, to throw away his sing, his little diamond. So he, he had an easy finesse. They had already easy, he, the, once he saw east show in or north rather but uh, show in on the third on the first club he knew he was cold. Okay, fast hand. Uh, is it going to be better for me to go queen? Yeah, queen of diamonds. 
I can't go down, can I? No, there's only one Trump outstanding now. Oh, he showed out. But I think that that was not, that was still fine. What happened here? Did I, what did I miss? What did I miss? I don't know what he pitched. If he pitched a diamond from King Doubleton, then I have another trick. What do they get? Two tricks? I'm not sure what, what you're asking about about the, the the Queen of Clubs is is he ha he had the finesse so so he he once once he saw that they had no clubs here he he could just lead the Jack of Clubs through the Queen like that and it doesn't matter what happens like like that and then the King of Spades throws away the diamond. Okay, I can't balance because I'm the one with heart length, so looks like they've overbid. I would love to make a penalty double, and especially now with King Jack third of spades hitting in the dummy. Warren played the two of spades. Uh, so it looks like Warren's got three spades. Or he's got a singleton, right? So, but he didn't three spades and he didn't bid. I can play the ace of clubs, and then the eight of diamonds, and then let's see, yeah, whatever. And then I'm gonna pitch the four, play the four of diamonds, so that he knows that I want a. I should maybe have just cashed the ace of spades right now, um, to get the club rough. I should have cashed the ace of spades, then I would definitely get the club rough. Might have blown a trick. Oh, maybe I blew a trick now. No. All the same. I think partner, if partner had nine doubleton or ten doubleton hearts, I'm getting all three hard tricks anyway. He did not have any more clubs anyway, did he? Seven, two, two, no he did. All right, we're creep clawing our way back here. Another five ball because they bid three spades with Warren's hand, which I have to admit I would probably have done as well with that singleton heart and three spades. Uh, I would have done it. Um, but he did well not to.
Well, it may not have a major. That makes it like point towards a heart, but man, King Queen nine fourth in this spot? Such an ugly lead. But what are my choices? I'm not gonna be the spade excuse me, a spade from Queen Fourth into the spade bidder. And obviously King Doubleton Diamonds is not happening. So the question is do I lead a club from three little or a heart? They had an invitational auction. Which means that they're in a touch and go game. I can count on Warren for about six points. I don't want to like bust open a heart suit for them. Like it just feels like that's such a bad idea. I think I'm gonna pop a club on the table and be done with it. Ah! Ah! I hate my life. What did I do? Well, that's just a practice match. What a brutal lead. It's not over. If partner has the ace of hearts, I could still take five tricks. But unfortunately, with him taking a year here over the nine of clubs, I don't think that the ace of hearts is his part of his points. This is one of the flaws of bridge in general. Like, like here, I have such a fixed amount of information. I know my partner has six points. So if he thinks for a year here and plays low on the nine of clubs, I know he doesn't have the ace of hearts. So where is the accountability on the rules for when I get in of knowing whether I should shift or not? I, okay, come on, heart shift. Heart shift. You've got the ten of hearts. And you're going to shift to a heart. Thank you. Come on, don't have ace-jack ten third. Thank you. Boom. Turns out... My lead was not so bad. Ace of clubs was just gold. Thank you very much. What a huge difference the ace was from the king. Oh, you're not taking a diamond hook just like that? Four, and if he takes four spade tricks and a diamond, don't pitch a spade. He didn't have the jack of spades. All right. That was lucky. I can breathe a sigh of relief. And we picked up a little, another bit, another little nibble. Oh, five. We're just fiving them to death. Look at that. Another five ball. And we're in the lead. Let's do it. Uh, worth a preempt vol against not. I'll probably score my queen of clubs. Might go for a number, but I have a doubleton heart and a stiff spade. Partner might get hooked out of the queen of spades because of my three diamond bid. No sacrifice available. I'm just gonna like, yeah, no. That's my brain at work when I'm deciding whether to preempt. Rob said that asked me if I was if I was getting close to, to to being over the hill this morning. I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm definitely older than I used to be. 
Now what? What did that say? Limit or better? I, I mean, what a gross lead. Do I just pop the ace of diamonds on the table? I mean, what else? I mean, I'm, what am I going to do? I'm going to, like, guess a heart. I don't really want to squeal about the diamond suit, though. That's the issue. It's like, if I, I don't want them to figure out that I have seven diamonds this early in the hand. But a stiff trump is insane, because I don't even know if they have four of them. Probably. He said limit plus. It should say how many trumps he has. I can't... I hate leading... Ja I'm leading the ace of diamonds, but it's just disgusting. Hopefully, they're seven, two, 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 and they won't figure it out. I mean, on the other side, hopefully I can give partner a rough. Uh, I'm going to play the nine of diamonds so that partner thinks that to give me a heart, and then they think declare partner has the jack of diamonds. No, he has no idea about the diamond situation. He just knows I just made a random lead. Okay, stiff trump would have worked just as well. So he's 5-2. You gotta win the ace and play a heart back, sir. You don't have any diamonds, so he's not gonna break diamonds. Seems insane to break clubs unless he's got jack 10, and even then, jack 10, unless he's got the eight, it's probably insane to fin play a club. Uh, yeah, heart back, that's what I'm saying, right? That has to be right. And he's gonna play a heart, try for them to break 3-3. Three, three. They're not. Oh, 4-2, okay. Ah, oh, this is just a nothing hand. Nothing hand. What are we wasting our time for here? One no opener, too good for one no. Not really, kind of. Yeah, maybe. If partner has the ace of clubs and the jack of diamonds, we'll make a game and I will have missed it. Uh, but I kind of have a good enough hand for a diamond. The problem is if I open a diamond, he bids a major and I bid three diamonds. We're not gonna, it's not gonna be easy to find a five, three major fit. I, I, whatever, we're down by three. I'm going for the goods right now. I hope this is not too strong. It's a little bit strong. Big clubs now. Oh, Warren and I play transfers after transfers. So he's going to, if he bids again, everything's a transfer, except 3-0. I'll see if he remembers it all. We haven't played in a long time. The last board we played was at the Bermuda Bowl, so that was the last time I streamed as well. So however long it's been since I've streamed is, is how long it's been since he and I have played together. Okay, so he's got clubs. Uh, I'm going to bid three hearts. And now his next bid should tell me the rest of his shape. Uh, none low high, or he might just bid four hearts. Show me your shape, sir, and then I'm going to Blackwood. I don't really really care what your shape is. If you're showing me your shape, you're interested in slam. Okay, none, low, singleton. So he's got, unfortunately, a singleton diamond and three spades. But I still have an, um, I still have a, what do I need? Ace, king, queen, ace? I mean, I don't even need that. I, I got to just key card. What am I going to do? I have a really good hand. Should I bid four clubs? Or should I just? They're going to lead a spade, unfortunately. So if he's got king, queen, jack, fifth of hearts, and ace, queen, 
Oh, we could be 5-5. Five, 5-5 five. Five, five would be a lot easier here. Um, my problem is I've got only only three little trumps, but yeah, what does he have? Like ace, queen, jack, fifth of clubs is seven, king of spades is ten, and the king of hearts would be thirteen. Anyway, I'm going to bid four clubs. If he s bids four hearts, I'm going to bid four spades, and then I'm going to let him key card, because if I key card and he shows me one, two without, two with, I'm just going to whatever. so random. The problem is my trumps suck. Ace, king, fifth, ace, and I'm cold though, so I, whatever. I'm just doing it. Um, no, I just open one no. It's not, yeah, I, I have a singleton king, so it's like a stopper anyway, and, and yeah, he's got two with the queen, so let's just hope that we're not, like, they don't lead a spade and have to knock out the ace of hearts. Okay, let's do it. I'm not happy with the singleton diamond. Um, yeah, no, I just I, I just decided to treat this hand as 15 to 17 balance. It's definitely not forcing. Just, just felt like this hand was worth showing 15 to 17. I hope he doesn't have king, queen, fifth of hearts. That would be the worst of all king queen fifth because then we need like three two trumps in the ace on side i'd even take king yeah i don't know ace king fifth of hearts though and we're just gonna be oh he's got the queen he's good so ace king queen fifth of hearts would be the dream have ace king queen fifth of hearts Whenever I'm thinking about whether to open one no, I think about my other options for how to bid the hand, and then I decide if one no will be a better description of my hand. And here, I decided that I preferred the route of opening one no trump to opening one diamond and jump rebidding three diamonds. Probably going to go down here, and I'm going to not have made the right decision, but you never know. It's, it's, uh, it's, it would have been if we do make it though. Opening one no made it a heck of a lot easier to get to this slam because if I opened a diamond a heart three diamonds, finding that five three heart fit, oh he had the nuts, the nuts. Three two trumps. Oh, he was going to slam anyway. Boo. Um, is there any way that I might be making? I might have the rest of the tricks, that's why I'm playing it out. Um, sorry, I missed a bunch of chat. Um, if yeah, you, in in the ACBL, uh, you can't uh, you can't open with a small singleton. What do I have? Seventeen here. One no. Um, you can't open with a small singleton. They'll just take the board away and give you a bad board. Uh, but you're not even allowed to discuss it that you're allowed to have a singleton. I'm pretty sure, at least unless they changed it more recently that you're... But yeah, singleton queen, singleton king, singleton ace allowed, singleton jack not. Um, uh, 
Yeah, exactly. I, I would not recommend opening one of Trump with singletons. I decided to do it for a whole bunch of reasons. My thought process took into account like just how hard it is to bid slams after a minor. I just felt like my hand was good for slam and 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 that it was it was the right time to do it. Um, uh, he could have corrected to six no. Did he? Yeah, I guess he knew I had sixteen. Yeah, he knew I had a club control. Uh, oops, I'm not passing. I'm bidding, or should I? So I'm allowed to pass this because he's five three three two. But what if he's got three little spades, ace queen jack, fifth of hearts? That's okay. That's almost nine right away. Queen jack, fifth of hearts, ace king of diamonds, and we're yeah we have to bid four hearts. I can't pass. Um, Oh, you're allowed in NABC Plus events? Okay, I didn't know that. That's good. Thank you very much. I'm going to use that at some point. So, like, even in the pair games? Okay. Spade, 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 rough. King of hearts, heart. Does that seem like a reasonable path forward? Yeah. And then I can just kind of afford to lose one club, one diamond, and one heart. Um, I wonder if it's maybe right for me to just play 10 of hearts and spin it instead of the king of hearts and a heart. No, it's the same, same business. Now jack, but that oh exposes me to an uppercut. But if I play low and they're four one on side, whatever. Well, are they 4-1? He didn't lead a singleton. I just don't believe it, so I'm going to just bang that guy down. Okay. Uh, we need, where's our five imps we need? We need one more little little swing here. I'm not going to lose sleep if we end up losing the match. At least it's a close one. Nice and exciting. watching i've got a lesson this friday it's on minor suit slam minor suit bidding after one no opener it's a, a cool new concept where i have a uh, you basically you sign up for the class and then you can immediately watch like a 25 30 minute video talking about how to bid minor suit hands over one no and then uh y there's a 20 board set that you can bid you can bid it on my on my website you can bid it on q bids you can download paper copies and bid them with your partner and uh, if you can do any of those things, and then on Friday at one o'clock, I'm going to meet in Zoom to go over questions and talk uh, talk through all the auctions, uh, which you can either watch live or come watch the recording. Most people who are watching this probably watch this after the thing was over, but it's still available. It's called uh, Minor Suit Hands After One No Trump Practice. It's, you go to WolperBridge.com. Right now, it's under Upcoming Lessons, but it's not going to be there for until pa after Friday. So, all right. Please show up. It's fifteen bucks. It's a lot, a lot of content for fifteen bucks. You get like two hours worth of video and a bunch of hands and mmm, tasty dummy.
Well, do I care if he starts giving his partner heart roughs? It feels like the King of Diamonds might actually be on side. Because he's led, what did he lead? The King of Spades and then the Queen of Spades. So he's got King, Queen, Jack of Spades, 6. The Ace of Hearts is 10. There's a chance the King of Diamonds is on side. Maybe I just let them take their roughs and hearts. I don't really care. Let me do that. They don't have Jack 10. Well, they might, but I'm, I'm just going to let them. Uh, I don't really care if it goes heart. To, I guess it's going to go Ace of Hearts, Heart, Rough, Spade. Or they might just pump a Spade back. In fact, they're going to put me right back in my hand, but whatever. Maybe I should have played the Queen of Hearts to try to sneak it through. It's hard for him to play a heart. I guess not. The ten's a weird card. He has to play the ace. Yeah. So lefties four five. Four five in the majors. Four five. What else is going on? He's four five two two. He didn't make a take a double, so he's not four five three one. King Queen Jack ten. Unless are they are they playing? They're obviously not playing. Although they might be playing Flannery. They're you guys playing Flannery? Trying to figure out which one of them has the fourth spade. If they don't play Flannery, then self has the fourth. Okay, thanks. Uh, so he's three five. No, he's four five on my left. So I can go Ace of Clubs, Queen of Clubs. What do I know? So I know he's got King Queen Jack of Spades. Ace Jack of Hearts is 11 points, so he doesn't really have to have anything else in his hand. Um, there's a good chance I'm going to be able to finesse the diamond, whether it's with the nine of hearts or no. If he's got five clubs, what is what if he's he doesn't have a stiff diamond on my left, right? So he's he's five four two two. That's what his shape is four five two two. So if it's Jack Doubleton of clubs. It's, or I could play the Queen of Clubs, and then North is going to have to be in. What if he's got King Jack, King? I feel like he's got another something over here. What is it, though? Or I can just play a Diamond. Yeah, Ace of Clubs. Queen of Clubs is dangerous. Okay, well that clarifies the situation just a little bit. Okay, so now I know this whole hand. He's four, five, three, one. Uh, that means that my right hand opponent has six clubs. Huh. What can I do? If I play the Queen of Hearts, he's gonna win and play a trump back. I just don't want him to throw away how many dimes does he have? He's six one. Three one three six. So I play the Queen of Hearts. He roughs it. He's gonna his best play is to play back a trump. In which case I can play a heart. He's gonna throw one of his diamonds. It's all the same. Alright, whatever. Hopefully he screws up now and plays back a diamond, not a trump.
<laughs> Funny though, if he plays back a diamond, I really like. I'm playing him to have made a really bad mistake by finessing, and I might be donating an under trick because he could go jack of hearts pitching a diamond, jack of spades pitching a diamond, or ten of spades, whatever's left. So I, I might go to bed with my ace of diamonds uh, when I have seven tricks. Yeah, okay, buddy, whatever. He made the right play. All right, I think I did okay to get up for down one on this hand. Cashing that ace of clubs is pretty useful. Uh, I don't know if I could have made it somehow, but... Club back by him. Smart play. I took six club tricks in the ace of diamonds. That's what I took. That's funny. I'm glad I didn't play the queen of clubs out of my hand. We didn't win a five ball. I thought we might win something on that board. They also played two clubs down one. I guess they also dropped the stiff king. No, they didn't. They did? Yeah. They did. How did he look? King of spades, queen of spades. He won, played the queen of hearts. He snuck a heart through. I should have done that. Ah, I said it at the time. I probably should have played the queen. But he shouldn't have ducked. All right, I am going to end the stream as soon as this hand is over. I thank you all. I might not see you for another six months, uh, but uh, we will. Uh, it's been fun. I've missed this for sure, but I don't know when I'm going to get a chance to do it again. Uh, but thank you. Well, our, we, do we, we have life if they overbid on this hand. If they got excited with Warren's hand, he had 14. We might go down in three, right? We might go down in three if it doesn't look like... Oh, th three doesn't look like it's going to go down. Yeah, no. Ace of clubs looks onside, but you never know. Ooh, that was not the winner. It's looking worse right now. Got to play a club now. Cash the king of spades and then play a club. Feels on side. Oh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, he can just draw trumps and then and then eventually he's gonna get the club finesse. They're, they're gonna only have clubs left at the end of this hand. Kind of hoping it's offside, but I really don't think that it is. The guy only had two spades, and, and he had ace-king-ace. Ace. All right. Thanks, everybody. Oh, that's what happened. Um, I, I, I didn't even read your last chats for, for, um, like for a while. I, 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 I had it scrolled up, and it was... Uh... Ace of clubs was offside. Do we, do we win a swing on the last hand? No, we lost three. How did we lose three? Uh, all right. Lost by six. Good match. Take it easy, everybody. I'll see you next time. Sign up for WolperBridge.com. Get my newsletter. I send hands and stuff out that don't all make it onto YouTube or Twitch. Uh, it's free. Just sign up for the account and put your email in there. See you later. Oh, and hit the like if you're watching on YouTube so that other people...